Hi, my name is Kai Prine and I am a Mechanical Engineering PhD student at the University of Utah College of Engineering and we have a ton of exciting stuff going on, so let's go take a look. This is the HGN lab for bionic engineering and here are a few of the devices that I get to work on. We have the hip exoskeleton and ankle exoskeletons. And these are wearable devices that we use to help people with mobility disabilities, for example, who've had a stroke or a spinal cord injury. And there are lots of other people working on lots of other cool devices, so we'll go talk to some of them next. Hey, Dante. Would you mind telling us a little bit about what you're working on? Yeah, certainly, Kai. So this is our newest hip exoskeleton. It assists people performing hip abduction and adduction, and I'm just adjusting some of the electronics and sensors of the device. Very cool. Hey, Vincent. Hey, Kai. Uh, do you mind telling us a little bit about the device that you're working on right now? Yeah, sure. So this is our knee exoskeleton, and we use it to assist people with climbing upstairs and climbing downstairs. Oh, that's awesome. Thank you. Hey, Marissa. Hey, Kai. Uh, will you tell me a little bit about what you're working on right now? Sure. So I am just putting together our powered knee prosthesis that's able to provide power to users when they climb up and down stairs, up and down ramps, and also just in walking. Hey, Hunor. Hey, Kai. Uh, well, tell me a little bit about your research. I'm working on blood flow simulations. We are using computational fluid dynamics to simulate how blood flows in certain arteries. And why do you like mechanical engineering? I like mechanical engineering because it's so broad and uh, it brings together so many different aspects of engineering. Awesome, thank you. Hey Bahar, how are you today? Hi Kai, how's it going? Going great, I was wondering, why did you choose the University of Utah for your graduate program? Because of good facilities, collaborative environment, and I guess I could follow my goals after graduation. That's awesome, and what are you researching? Uh, my research focuses on microfluidics, which basically in simple terms means creating small affordable devices to um, work with small amounts of liquid. Hey, Dr. Lindsay. Hey, Kai. Uh, why did you choose the University of Utah? Well, Utah has a great history of like building bionic technologies and robotics and a great engineering school. Plus, I have a beautiful view out here and I love the outdoors. Um, you know, I go out skiing with my family every weekend and we've got the best slopes in the world. Oh, yeah, I also love to ski here. It's great. Hey, Matthias. Hey, Kai. What kind of work are you doing here? I work on a project that brings together virtual reality as well as physical interactions to help build better solutions for new therapy methods and mental health applications. So right now, I'm in a virtual environment, an outdoor environment, um, and I'm getting haptic feedback from the surrounding area uh, and the animals that are here. Um, and the goal for this project is to essentially use it to further research in therapy and different therapy methods. And what's the community like here in the Department of Mechanical Engineering? So the community here is actually pretty great. It's one of the reasons I chose to come to the U. Um, there's constantly events happening organized by either students or faculty, things like grills, barbecues, uh, food events, distinguished seminars. Hey, Ian. Hey, Kai. When did you know mechanical engineering was your calling? So I first got interested in mechanical engineering when I was really young and I liked to take apart electronics and put them back together incorrectly and they never worked. So I decided that I'd like to learn how to do stuff correctly and make stuff work well. <laughs> that is great. I'm sure your parents were super happy that you know how to fix things now. For sure. <laughs> well, that's just a quick tour of some of the mechanical engineering labs we have here at the University of Utah. Again, we have a ton of cool stuff going on, so come visit us, come join us, and go Utah. <laughs>